I love the atmosphere in the city center in the morning. I came in here at nine o'clock and it was just so quiet with still a pulse like people had started to wake up, work. I just love that. I just love the morning vibe. So I have been getting my eyelashes done. As you can see, they now look amazing again. So that was great. And uh, now I'm gonna hit out and get a warmer for the basement, like a thing that you can have standing, putting like hot air out. Because I'm so, so tired of being really cold, exhausted and unwell when I get back in the afternoon. And they say that it's gonna be even colder throughout the next week or so. So I really feel like it's about time to get one. So we're gonna go out and see if we can get one now before I'm gonna hit to work. So let's do that. kind of has a weird smell. I don't know if it's because it's new and I just like turned it on. It might just need to warm up and I don't know. But it's already heating, like you can already feel it. It's by the way been going very well with all of the new spring items. I think the most popular dress has still been this one, but we have sold a few of the rose maxi as well. And look at this beauty that I hung up yesterday. It is so so beautiful it's also up on the web shop now the rest of the store looks kind of like it always does not much has changed oh this one has been sold through direct message on instagram a lot of people contact me there and i'll be like you sent me a picture of that one or what's the size of that one and then we sell some of the pieces through instagram story story yeah story and messages it smells weird like that one the warmer Hey guys, it's Thursday morning, it's Julianne's birthday and I've just gone by the bakery to get two buns for the day and now I am going to go buy a thrift shop. I'm going to go out this Saturday to celebrate Julianne's birthday and I only own like crossover bags that are this size. It's huge and it's just not a nice sized bag to bring with you when you go clubbing because it's not nice to dance with that big of a bag hanging across your body so i want to go buy a thrift shop and see if i can find a small one it would be really nice i don't have a lot of time um but i want to do that before work today and so yeah we're gonna head out it's not a bad weather today i hope it's gonna stay like this you can like see the light coming through the clouds i would love if it could stay like this throughout the day so let's head out thrifting It's still here. I tried it on two weeks ago. Just consider how much black cloth you can get like there's so so much and then like colorful clothing I would say this is colorful that's colorful that's semi colorful so it's like two racks but you can get so much black oh that's pretty cute that I kind of like this is an okay size to have as a crossover back just look how long this strap is it's around my knee <laughs> I think you can make it shorter I just don't know if it's too small yep this one is too small that it, I can't even fit my phone in here so that's not gonna work 
And then there is this one. I really like the shape of it, but I don't know if I'll use it because the colors are brown. I'm almost forgetting to vlog because I thought I'm just going to spend, I had one hour before opening, I thought I'm going to spend it well. So I want to take some pictures of a few vintage pieces and then I put this on and I can't sell it. Like I'm serious this time. This one I can't sell. I need to keep it. It's my dream 70s dress. It's so beautiful. It has long sleeves, which is something I find really important. It's super long. It almost fits me perfectly. It's on, only a little bit too big. I don't know if I can make this shorter or like smaller in some way. It's so beautiful, guys. This is, oh, you can't see all of me, but this is the dress. It's so beautiful. It's like my dream. It's my dream dress. I can't sell it. It's just so beautiful. Oh, look at the pattern. But therefore, I've decided I'm going to take pictures of something else. Something that there is a risk that I'm also going to fall for. But this is the one that I'm now going to try on and see if that's better. This is just like made for me. I can't sell it. I can't. This one is of course also absolutely stunning, but luckily it is for someone who is a lot taller than me. Um, I'm wearing some very high heels and I think it's still touching the floor. Like I am only 162 centimeters tall, so I'm a small girl. This would be a lot better on someone like my sister, but it's so beautiful. Like look at the sleeves, it's gorgeous. I'm gonna put you there and then, oh, still can't show you all of it. But it looks like this and then it's like super duper long i'm wearing super high heels but it's so so gorgeous and then it has a tie on the back it is kind of like a little bit princessy i think it's really pretty it looks like i've got mail maybe i am done running around running around outside in the cold <laughs> Um, I think I managed, I think I did, I managed to shoot my outfit and then a vintage dress and then a vintage outfit and then we took some pictures of a recycled dress and then we took some pictures of Michelle in one of the recycled dresses that are like one of a kind. So I've been outside for about one and a half hour I think. So I'm now wrapping the present for Juliana, I just wanted to show you what I'm gonna give her. She have been talking about this yellow cardigan from the boutique for quite a while and I actually told her that she could pay for it whenever she had the money so she had left it down here but I've now like wrapped it up and then I'm gonna give her the Picasso ring because I can't remember which of the rings it is that she likes so I'm just thinking I'm gonna take a chance and if she wants something else then she can return it Ej, jeg tror egentlig, at jeg filmer dig egentlig altid åbne gaver på den første dag. Jeg har tænkt over det. Det er det kryde. Nej, jeg har nogen kunst i sko. Der var den! Der er Picasso! This sky makes me feel so, so happy. It's so pretty, a blue sky. We have not had a blue, blue sky like this um, for weeks like weeks it's serious it's been such bad weather so seeing a blue sky at sunset time it's magical <laughs> so juliana's been a good girl over the past year apparently i am now gonna go to my mom's directly to my mom's juliana and mom actually came down here and uh, my mom came with home baked buns and we had a uh, cozy time and then um I promised them that I will come by mom's house when I close the boutique. So that's now. We're gonna go to Julianne's, celebrate her and uh, have a cozy, cozy night. I'm waiting for my family. We are out for a buffet. Can't wait, I'm really hungry. This is what the lights come from. Hey! 
Luna! <laughs> Kom du! Kom kig! Se! Se på den tæppe! I've been cleaning Luna's things this morning, so she just got her duvet back. That was good, boo. That was really good. And that also means that I'm now ready to head to work. I've been cleaning my apartment all day because yesterday was my sister's birthday. And tomorrow, Saturday, she will be having some girls over here. Um, so therefore I've like cleaned, tidied, organized so that it's nice and ready for her to celebrate her birthday here. So my bedroom is nice and tidy and the living room is nice and clean and tidy. And I've just found some party things that I have from a party I've held like years ago. So I'm done washing. This is my outfit of the day. I'm still trying to wear bright colors because I'm so ready for spring. So I'm wearing this blouse that I found in a thrift shop, this beautiful dress that's also, it's vintage dress, and then some mustard colored tights. I'm wearing my glasses and my earrings from the web shop. They're so cute. Head to work because I'm going to pack orders today. So I better get down there and get started. It's now half past 12. I've had my first customer of the day, which is great. I've also packed orders. There weren't that many today. It's been a very quiet week. I think it's because it's been the last week of the month. That's when people don't really have any more money. And also we have a huge vintage drop coming today, Friday. We've been shooting pieces yesterday and uh, the day before to get ready. So I'm actually just working from my PC at the minute in the boutique, like trying to get everything up and ready till 3 p.m. So that's what I'm currently doing. I just thought I would show you a few of my favorites of the pieces that are going to drop today. They are all hanging out here. And I have some favorites. One of my favorites is this one that I just think is so gorgeous. It's very long, so it's looked too long for me. I actually showed you this yesterday in my vlog. Now I remember, I'm absolutely in love with that one. Hey guys, it is half past five. I have half an hour left here. I'm gonna close at six on Fridays from now on. Um, it's been a good day. Michelle and I, we have had a good day, good chats, took some pictures. Also, the big vintage drop is now up. We have already sold some pieces, but my favorite bits are still there. So um, yeah, it's been a really good day. Really has. And now I have uploaded, I wanted to ask my Patreons, Michelle and I are gonna do a thrift challenge next week. And I wanted to have some guidelines or some like things for us to follow, maybe a budget or a purpose with the whole video. So I have asked my lovely Patreons to give us some challenges and I can't wait to see what they come up with. So we're gonna film that next week. It's just been a really nice chill, day with like customers coming in once in a while a green a green sky <laughs> that would be interesting the blue sky outside and uh yeah it's just been good <laughs> so michelle and i took some pictures today we made some really cute outfits i wanted to take some pictures wearing this one because i think it's so strange that it hasn't been sold yet I tried it on a long, long time ago and it's just super duper cute. I love the pattern and the colors, but because I had forgotten to charge my camera, <laughs> we could only take a few pictures. So I have not been wearing anything today, but it's super cute. It's still there. Send me a direct message if you fall in love with it. That one is also still up for sale. I think it's crazy that it's still there. It's so beautiful. So yeah, I'm just waiting for the next half hour to just go and then I can go home. I'll be here again tomorrow, but <laughs> I'm just quickly, I'm gonna stop by a supermarket on the way back home because I know that we don't have anything really for Luna. And I think she would love me if I bring home some carrots. So I'm just gonna go in and see if I can find a few bits. Um, Hi! See? Jeg er nødt med til dig. 
I've just cleaned the floor, boo. What have you been doing? Here you go. See? And they're organic. Yes, they're organic. Yeah, you're so ready to have one. Loon? Loon? Come. Good girl. And now she doesn't really know where she can eat it without me stealing it. So I actually have to leave the room. I was a crazy uncomfortable dude in the supermarket. He was an alcoholic and he even touched my hair. He came really close. I was really uncomfortable. He said things like, um, have you heard things about redheads? And then he just laughed. He was so uncomfortable. He keep, kept like talking to me, saying things I didn't even understand and oh hey guys my phone is charging and i was just about to take off my clothes clean off my makeup and go to bed so i just wanted to end my vlog here luna is right under like the table here um i'm back home again want to call luna and just have a chill night we were watching x factor at my brother's it was super cozy um and now i just want to end the vlog here so leave a thumbs up if you enjoyed it i'm planning to have it up yesterday yesterday tomorrow <laughs> on saturday so um i will try my best to edit it and have it up saturday so i hope that you enjoyed it leave a thumbs up if you did and i'm gonna see you all very soon